Is the New Republic's amnesty program for ex-Imperial officers really a good idea? On the surface, it seems like a noble effort to help those rejected by or refusing to join the Imperial remnants after the Galactic Civil War. The program offered them housing and positions in the new government to help them start over, free from the Emperor's brainwashing. But the truth is, this program is anything but benevolent. The former Imperials are identified by alphanumeric ID codes and their position in the Empire, not their names, and they were required to wear an A on their uniforms like a scarlet letter. I know it's a security measure, but it also ensures they're kept separate and identifiable to everyone around them. What's even worse is that the New Republic is essentially brainwashing these individuals to be loyal to them, using tactics reminiscent of the Empire's own brainwashing programs. So in a twisted way, the New Republic is using Imperial tactics to create a new generation of loyal followers.